Yo guys, yeah man, I just wanted to update this this life of an entrepreneur behind the scenes vlog. Even the best of us get it wrong sometimes, yeah, and make fuck ups. Mate, I can't believe I just made one of the biggest fuck ups I ever done in regards to putting on events, yeah. Imagine so <laughs> do my event the return of double pleasure. By the time you see this, this is gonna be way past it, but yeah. The return of double pleasure VIP, putting the event on the amount of cock ups I've made during this year. But the major one now is that basically it's on a bank holiday. So basically, the Queen's Jubilee. I've gone to the venue, I've always wanted to do it on a Sunday. So normally, you do it on a Sunday. It's Sunday 5 to 11. Obviously, I'm hearing this bank holiday, bank holiday. And I spoke to the venue, I was like, raw, like, I should do the event. Later then, they're like, yeah, we think you should do the event later, in it Because uh, it's about holiday, like, and it suits us better. So do it 8 till 2, not 5 to 11. So I'm like, okay, cool. So I've paid ad, spent like £500 on ads. Advertising 8 till 2, sent out bare messages, maybe a thousand messages. Say 8 till 2, about holiday weekend, yeah. Then my brethren messages me, and like, bro, it's, it's not bank holiday. I was like, what do you mean bank holiday? He said, yeah, it's bank holiday, but... It's bank holiday Thursday and Friday. Both days. It's not Friday and Monday no more. Or in general, it's Thursday and Friday. So you shouldn't do bank holiday Sunday. I was like, what? So I've had to check the thing now, yeah. Please believe it's fucking bank holiday Thursday and Friday. So I've now I've had to I've kind of wasted money, but now I've had to change all the promo edit. So it says Back to 5 to 11. Have to call the venue tomorrow. Tell them raw, like... I don't even know why they agreed to me to do it. They just think, like... Obviously, they didn't want to come in earlier, innit? But, yeah, they're going to have to come in earlier because it's not fucking Bank Holiday Sunday. Anyway, I'm pissed because... It's not like a major, major... But well, this is a fuck-up, you get me? It's a mad fuck-up still. And, um... This isn't... A, this is probably the worst mess up I've done yeah I remember back in the day when I hadn't done anything for ages and me and my boy we done an event we printed 10,000 flyers these were the days of flyers yeah printed 10,000 flyers and forgot to put the date on it <laughs> pissed we couldn't believe we forgot to put the date on it so then basically we still gave out those flyers don't get it twisted and people's like when is it when is it like then we just told them obviously we gave it to them in it but then anyone that we gave a flyer to you, they didn't know. It kind of worked in our favour because they didn't know when the event was, but they heard about it because they still had the details. So then by the time the event happened, it still went all right because people it built up a little interest. People was like, I heard this event, but I don't know when it is. Like, when is it? Do you know what I mean? And then, yeah, it went well, but like, man, I can't believe this. I made this mistake today. So guys, like, you're never too experienced to make mistakes, man. You've heard about big companies making mistakes, and this is my mistake of the day that I'm having to rectify financially. Big up.